allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Morning Shores. These are daily announcements for Tuesday, September 13th, 2016. I'm Caden. And I'm Noah. If you hope to join the National Honor Society this year, an email invitation has been sent to all qualifying students. If you received an email, then your GPA qualifies you to apply for NHS membership. The membership application is attached to the email. Please print it, complete it, and return it to Ms. Wallach by Friday. It will take some time to complete, so print it and get to work as soon as possible. Please see Ms. Wallach or Ms. Brown for questions. Interact is looking for new members and we need students to work at Irish Festival next weekend. Many shifts available Friday through Sunday. Please see Ms. Conrad in room 405 ASAP if you think you can help. Also, there will be an Interact meeting after school today. New members are welcome. We will be discussing our fundraisers and service projects and trips this year. Wow, I love Ms. C. This first business professionals of America meeting will be held tomorrow at 9 a.m. in Miss Saylor's classroom, 401. This is a late start Wednesday. We'll be providing information about joining the student organization this school year. The LMC will not be open after school this week. Sorry for the inconvenience. All juniors will take the PS All juniors will take the PSAT and MSQT on Wednesday, October 19th. The PSAT is an assessment administered to 10th and 11th grade students to help prepare them. For the SAT, college, and careers, you can receive detailed online score reports. To receive the online report, you will need a College Board account. Every Tuesday and Thursday morning, 7 to 7.30 a.m., you can come to the LMC to receive help with your College Board account and link it to Khan Academy to receive a personalized practice. Sophomores who are interested in taking the PSAT on October 19th should attend one of the help sessions. Do you like science? Regardless, there will be a science club meeting held in Ms. Buskin's room, hashtag 623, after school today. Everyone is invited to come. If you are interested in theater auditions for the Mona Shores Players, fall production of Robin Hood will be today and tomorrow from 4 to 6 p.m. in the dance room. Get involved in one of the biggest events of the fall. Anyone interested in being involved in this production is encouraged to attend. No experience is necessary. If you have any questions, see Mr. Martin in room 622. Student drivers, you must have your vehicles registered by this Friday. If you applied for an e-slot parking permit, you can check the list posted on the office window. If your name appears on the list, please exchange your old pass with a new pass for Miss Lund in the front office. God, I love her. You have a chance to win a free yearbook. Follow at the Sailor's Log on Instagram and Twitter by Friday for a chance to be randomly selected to win a free yearbook. One winner will be chosen from Instagram and one will be chosen from Twitter. This Saturday is the annual Marching Band Marchathon, a fundraising event to help band members and the Band Parents Association earn money to cover program expenses. The band will march five one-mile routes through various Norton Shores neighborhoods. This year's routes can be viewed at monashoresband.org. Donations will be accepted along any of the five routes. For $25, the band will stop and play a song anywhere along the routes, along with traditional Mona Shores favorites. Selections from this year's show, Magical Mystery Detour, will be included in the Marchathon playlist. Please come out and support the Mona Shores Marching Band while enjoying their marching and music. Look for them in a neighborhood near you. Interested in writing about topics that interest you? Would you like to write for fun? Writers come to the next writing club meeting after school on Thursday in Ms. Brower's room. Hashtag 311. Mona Shores Robotics will begin meeting soon. Veteran members, check your email. We'll meet tomorrow in Mr. Bassey's CAD lab at 3 o'clock. New members and those interested in more information are welcome to join us Wednesday the 21st in Mr. Bassey's CAD Lab, room 620 from 3 to 345 with a big group graduating. We are looking for students interested in electronics, design, fabrication, assembly, programming, business, marketing, web design, presentation, fundraising, grant writing, and more. If you can't make it on the 21st, stop in to see Mr. Bassey for more information. Good morning, Mona Shores. Good morning, Mona Shores. I'm gonna show you how to use your parking passes. Uh, here we have this beautiful red car, but it's got a pass from a year ago. Don't do that. That's not, that's not allowed. Here we have a Buick Century, year 2000. And this person has parked over the line The famous rapper Tupac Shakur 
was shot and killed 20 years ago. One year ago, Germany introduced temporary border controls to send the tide of thousands of refugees. In 1501, Michelangelo started work on his famous statue of David. Ben Savage from the shows Boy Meets World and Girl Meets World was born in 1980. Happy birthday, Roald Dahl, author of famous children books such as James and the Giant Peach and Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. One last happy birthday to Niall Horan of One Direction. Happy 23rd, babe. Seven years ago today, I, Macy Shimetta, got a haircut. This is Sailor Country, and we do everything with pride. I'm Dylan. There will be a spirit bus going to Reese Puff for this Friday for the varsity football game. The cost is $3, which includes the ride and your ticket, or it's free if you have the whiteout shirt. Shirts are available in the athletic office for $10. The JV girls golf team played in the Granville Invitational yesterday at Maple Hill. Ellie Zudema, Taylor Strandberg, Megan Swanker, and Morgan Ralston were top scorers for the Sailor squad. Way to go, Sailors. The varsity golf team got the conference season started off with a win, edging out Reese Puffer by three strokes for a team total of 194. Erica Doriot tied for medalist honors with a 45, followed by Logan Potts with a 46. Lauren Wozni carded a 50, while Taylor Keeson had a 53. Brooke Southland shot a 48 in exhibition. The Sailors traveled to Lincoln Golf. Today in sports, the soccer teams traveled to Fruitport, and the volleyball teams traveled to Jenison. It's a heart of 73! And a low 61. We have for you today, sailors. Have a lovely Tuesday. We can turn on the lights and head back to the house, or we can take another ride on my big green tractor. We can go slow or make it go faster down through the woods and out to the pasture. Long as I'm with you, it really.